Kill a man, and you are a murderer. Kill millions of men, and you are a conqueror. Kill everyone, and you are a god. Science has made us gods, even before we are worthy of being men. The obligation to endure, gives us the right to know. Think. Why think? We have computers to do that for us. My pessimism extends to the point of even suspecting the sincerity of the pessimists. A body of work such as Pasteur's is inconceivable in our time. No man would be given a chance to create a whole science. Nowadays a path is scarcely opened up when the crowd begins to pour in. It is horrible to see everything that one detested in the past, coming back wearing the colors of the future. To be an adult is to be alone. We spend our time envying people whom we wouldn't wish to be. A man is not old, as long as he is seeking something. When I was young I pitied the old. Now old, it is the young I pity. Marriage simplifies life, and complicates the day. In politics, yesterday's lie is attacked only to flatter today's. To live is often to struggle toward goals one has no desire to reach. In our ideals we unwittingly reveal our vices. There are moments when very little truth would be enough to shape opinion. One might be hated at extremely low cost. The ideal, without doubt, varies, but its enemies, alas, are always the same. The biologist passes, the frog remains. There are some persons we could not cut down to size, without diminishing ourselves as well. Science had better not free the minds of men too much, before it has tamed their instincts. The nobility of a human being is strictly independent of that of his convictions. What makes our opponents useful is that they allow us to believe that without them, we would be able to realize our goals. Being right is less important to us than the freedom to be wrong. I should have no use for a paradise in which I should be deprived of the right to prefer hell. Nothing leads the scientist so astray as a premature truth. Stupidity, outrage, vanity, cruelty, iniquity, bad faith, falsehood. We fail to see the whole ray, when it is facing in the same direction as we. We find it easy to believe that praise is sincere. Why should anyone lie, in telling us the truth? Take heed of critics, even when they are not fair. Resist them even when they are. We give others praise which we ourselves don't believe, as long as they respond with praise, we can believe. 
The divine is perhaps that quality in man, which permits him to endure the lack of God. We must watch over our modesty in the presence of those who cannot understand its grounds. Somebody told me I should put a pebble in my mouth to cure my stuttering. Well, I tried it, and during a scene I swallowed the pebble. That was the end of that. To reflect is to disturb one's thoughts. It is sometimes important for science to know how to forget the things she is surest of. Certain brief sentences are peerless in their ability to give one the feeling that nothing remains to be said. Falsity cannot keep an idea from being beautiful. There are certain errors of such ingenuity that one could regret their not ranking among the achievements of the human mind. To be able to observe with a stranger's eye helps one to see with an artist's eye. What alienates us inspires. The books one has written in the past have two surprises in store. One couldn't write them again and wouldn't want to. On the brink of being satiated, desire still appears infinite. A few great minds are enough to endow humanity with monstrous power, but a few great hearts are not enough to make us worthy of using it. Truth is always served by great minds, even if they fight it. It is horrible to see everything that one detested in the past coming back wearing the colors of the future. One must either take an interest in the human situation, or else parade before the void. Already at the origin of the species, man was equal to what he was destined to become. In art as in life, the valid sacrifices are those that bring no income. Prerequisite for re-readability in books. That they be forgettable. Literature. Proclaiming in front of everyone what one is careful to conceal from one's immediate circle. To love an idea is to love it a little more than one should. One must credit an hypothesis with all that has had to be discovered in order to demolish it. The least one can say of power is that a vocation for it is suspicious. There are big and little truths but all belong to the same race. There are things that don't deserve to be said briefly. I prefer the honest jargon of reality to the outright lies of books. Do not try to understand women because only women understand women and they hate each other. To say of men that they are bad is to say they are worse than we think we are or worse than the ideal man whose image we have built up on the basis of a certain few. Whether man is disposed to yield to nature or to oppose her, he cannot do without a correct understanding of her language. We are not naive enough to ask for pure men. 
We ask Millie for men whose impurity does not conflict with the obligations of their job. A married couple are well suited when both partners usually feel the need for a quarrel at the same time. It is sometimes well for a blatant error to draw attention to over-modest truths. Never feel remorse for what you have thought about your wife. She has thought much worse things about you 